what's up guys welcome back to another tutorial so today i want to show you how to download openstreetmap data and then load it inside uh, an arcmap uh, software so what we need to do is to head to the web browser so that we can download uh, the data from the openstreetmap so on the search bar just type openstreetmap and uh, hit enter uh, you click on the first link that has www.openstreetmap.org click on that and then uh, search uh, search the place that you want to download the data and then click export it's going to open up this uh, uh, navigation pen and then uh, so under export you should be able to see this uh, small link that says manually select a different area click on that and then uh, you can now adjust the extent of the uh, the extent of your area that you want to download the data i think uh, mine is correct that way and then can actually extend a little bit like so and then uh, click export and you can see that uh, the download is complete so I can head right to the download and then I just click that I can click close that uh, so I'm going to copy paste the data inside this folder that I've created for the purpose of storing this and then go to so now that we have the data we can now uh, open the ArcGIS software and then go to uh, Arc toolbox just open up the Arc toolbox So now the Arc, tool, Arc Toolbox is open. You should be able to see uh, the Open Street Map Toolbox uh, if you have it installed. So if you don't have, uh, if you have not installed the uh, that kind, the Open Street Map uh, Toolbox, let me show you how to uh, download it and then install. So open up the web browser and then type. Uh, uh, I'll provide a link for this. Uh, so ArcGIS OSM editor and then click enter then uh, choose the github one uh, select the github uh, choose the link that has uh, github.com uh, so with this S3 uh, extension so click on that and then it's going to open up this uh, window go to instruction so under instruction uh, the different links depending on the different versions of uh, ArcGIS so if you have if you have 10.3 click on the first link 10.4 it has a different link 10.5 so mine is uh, 10.8 so I have ArcGIS 10.8 just click on that link particular link and then uh, it will take you to the download page so give it time to to open and then click on the download so I'm going to cancel this or let me just download it but uh, I have already downloaded it in the computer, so the ones that I need for me to download, but uh, let me sh just show you how to do it. So 
so the download is complete you can now close the browser and then uh, go to download and then I'm going to cut and then paste inside this uh, uh, folder then just click on it and right click to extract so I'm going to extract in the same folder and it's going to open up these two uh, uh, these two folders uh, you can double click on any you can choose this one or you can choose the second folder and then uh, double click on it to just install then click yes so it's just the normal uh, installation procedure just click next 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 and then now uh, it says finished so I don't need to do this because I, I already have it installed so you can now restart your arc map and then go to open street map and before we're going to load the data and before you, uh, you decide to load the data uh, you need to create a file geodatabase so click on catalog or you can click it here click on catalog and then it's going to open up this uh, catalog window so navigate to the place that you want to uh, store or to uh, store your file geodatabase for this case I'm going to open uh, where I want it uh, installed stored and then uh, right click on the folder so right click on it and uh, let me do it again just right click and then uh, place your cursor on the new then what you want is file your database so choose file your database and then give it a name and just say open something like let me rename it again open street street map data like that and then click enter so uh, you can now uh, go to the open up the arc catalog again and then go to open street map uh, toolbox expand click on that plus sign to expand and then double click on load uh, down, uh, download OSM data open street map data double click on that and then uh, not download actually sorry about that load load uh, open street map file double click and then uh, click on that uh, and navigate to where the location of your, where you have your data um, and mine is inside desktop then I have it here click open just give it time to load the data and then uh, so under target feature data set click on that and then go to the location of your file your database where you actually created your file your database and then double click double click on the file your database to op open it and then uh, give the name your data a name let's say something like that any other name is not a must that you give it the same name as this one then click save and then click okay and let it uh, so you can see at the bottom here uh, the process is ongoing so you need you don't need to rush the software just give you time to to complete the process
Now you can see uh, we have the data here. The data is, the data is loaded. Uh, you can now go ahead and start manipulating the data. You can actually open the attribute table to look at the nodes. So in this case, I, I really don't think I need this. Now, if you zoom in, so let's go to to the polygon. Right click on the polygon and then open uh, attributes. Go to properties and then uh, if you have something like a block, just go to uh, categories and then under unique values choose uh, let's say building and then uh, uncheck this uncheck that one and then uh, click on the all values so that it is going to uh, separate uh, these blocks depending on the type of uh, of buildings and then click apply and OK. So that's it. Uh, that's how you can actually uh, download data from uh, OpenStreetMap and then uh, load the same data into uh, an ArcGIS application. So that's it, that's it for this tutorial. Uh, see you in the next tutorial.